hello 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 welcome back to my channel this is your tbqbc and today we're going to be talking about how you guys can increase sales on your tiktok shop so number one you guys to increase sales on your tiktok shop you have to use discount code or you can offer free shipping offer discount code or offer free shipping to increase sales on your tiktok shop that's the only way it's gonna work why i tell you that is because Sorry, I'm getting distracted with this thing over here. Why I tell you that is because, prime example, for me, um, I think it was about last week. Yeah, it was last week. And I realized that I did not make any sales on, um, on for my last week orders. Well, for last week. Let's just say for last week, I didn't make any sales. No sales came in. Nobody bought from me, right? So, I didn't really notice it, but I started noticing why I don't have any sales coming in? I'm, I'm surprised because usually I get two to three sales a day or every other day I'll get two to three sales. So maybe a little higher than that. So I go to check my phone. I go on my laptop as a matter of fact to go check what's going on. And I realized that the coupon code that I had, and I think that coupon code was either for um, January I set it up for or something like that. I can't really remember. But it was for January. I realized that coupon code ended on January 2nd. So I set it up for January 1st. And for some reason, it ended, it ended on January 2nd. I'm not too sure why. I don't know what's going on with TikTok shop. And if there's something, if, if this is something new that they're doing. But usually my coupon code will last for a week. Or more than a week. Maybe a month. The coupon code will last. The promo will keep going on for. So... What I did was, I went back into my TikTok shop. I went to my um, promotion. Um, after I click on promotion, I clicked on, um, oh yeah, duplicate. I duplicated the coupon because I figured out how to, learn, how to use that tool. So when you duplicate the coupon, you could just duplicate it. And you won't have to make a whole new coupon or discount code all over again one by one for each product like putting the percentages and stuff like that once you duplicate it you ready to go all you have to do is change the name of the promotion that you are selling to uh, that you are giving to your customers so i duplicated the coupon i changed the name i put a whole different name um as my coupon name so customers could see that when i um could see that when it comes to my TikTok shop and I set it up as 15% so you guys if you're selling the product set your product up for the certain amount of percentage that you that you want that you would like for you to give your customers set it up for a certain amount of percentage the next thing the next thing I did was I offer free shipping so I had set up free incentive shipping I believe I think I still got that coupon going on for right now too um my free shipping is unlimited free shipping but i don't i don't even think some of these customers realize that that i'm offering free shipping because tiktok be doing their own little discount too so i don't think some of my customers realize that i offer free shipping i think i only got like two orders no it was three orders that i got that i had to pay for shipping for but even if you do pay for shipping tiktok is going to pay you back for that shipping even if you offer a discount code tiktok is going to pay you back for that discount code yes they're going to take a pc because that's tiktok and every other platform that you sell on they're going to take a certain amount or percentage off of what you're making after your customers receive their product so you guys if you want to increase sales use give your customers coupon code everyone knows that customers people love discount even yourself you love discount why wouldn't i love discount i love discount i save a lot of money using a discount code so it's like if somebody's selling something for 25 dollars and you have it for 10 dollars who you think they're gonna go to 25 or 10 you both of you guys sell the same product both of you sell the same product the only difference is one is higher, one is lower. I'd rather go to the person that's selling it for $10 because I could buy two or I could just buy one. Do you get, do you see what I'm saying here? I'd rather go to the person that's selling it for $10. Not because, oh my God, um, $25 I cannot afford. It's not that I cannot afford, I can afford $25.
I just don't want to spend twenty five dollars on the product if somebody else is selling it for cheaper, and I could get it for cheaper, and I could always buy two or I could always buy one instead of buying one for the full price. Do you guys get what I'm saying? So offer free shipping. Even if you see somebody else has the same product as you, I would suggest you to do what to do is to bring your product down a certain amount um to a certain amount. So if they're selling it for if they that person is selling it for fifteen, drop it down to like twelve, eleven dollars. Drop it down to like twelve, eleven dollars, and I guarantee you customers will buy from you. I guarantee you when you offer the free coupon they will come to you and buy from you and buy and oh, I'm sorry guys they will come to you and buy from you you have to offer a coupon guys and I know I, I I feel like my words is um a little coming out off because yeah I speak another language so my language be my accent be messing messing up with my English accent and stuff like that so that's what you have to do guys I offer what I do is I offer free shipping and I have fifteen percent off. Yeah, I have fifteen percent off a majority of the items that I sell, and I also um yeah, fifteen percent off of the item that I sell, and I also I offer free shipping. But as I said from before, I don't think a lot of customers realize that I give out free shipping because TikTok they be doing their own little thing with the free shipping and then with the discount code too, cause. I could offer a, um, my discount code and TikTok offer the discount code. So sometimes I think TikTok will let you use both or you will have to pick one in between. I'm not really too sure about that part. Yeah, I just know how to set up my coupons and give discount out to my customers. But if you want to make sales, once you would like to increase your sales, if you're new to TikTok shop and you're trying to make sales, Take good quality pictures of your product and offer coupons to your customers. I guarantee you, your customers will be buying from you. I guarantee you, you will see your sales start increasing. I guarantee you, it's not going to be only one sale. It's going to be a couple of sales. I did it. You can do it too. If I could do it, you could do it, you guys. Offer that free coupon. Don't be mad that you're going to lose money. Don't look at it like that. Do not look at it like that. Don't be mad. Or oh, I'm not going to make no money if I bring the price cheaper. Do not look at it like that. What are you offering to your customers? If you could offer that to your customers for a lower price, of course people are going to start buying from you. But, like I said, if somebody's offering it for $25, there's a high chance that nobody want to buy it for $25. Because, first of all, and then that's another thing. We're in a time where finance is hard and it's hitting people. So, why not offer that free coupon? Why not offer a discount? If you do these things, you guys, I guarantee you, your sales going to increase. You could, also, you could do coupon, you could do discount. Or you could do free shipping. You could even do all three because sometimes I, I usually do all three. But sometimes I think when you're on the customer side and you're buying, I think the customer could only pick one out of them three. So it's either you're going to have to pick coupon, the free shipping, or I think you could get the coupon and the free shipping together. But you're going to have to pick between the coupon and I think is um with TikTok discount or whatever TikTok you have going on because... I noticed that too when I also my free shipping. I mean, when I also when I offer my coupon codes, I noticed that TikTok go around my whole TikTok shop putting twenty five dollars off, twenty five dollars off, twenty five. You like basically you have to spend over twenty five dollars. I think you have to spend twenty five dollars. I, I can't remember. I just know it's twenty five dollars. You have to spend a certain amount to get twenty five dollars off. So I don't know if TikTok is in competition. With their coupon, with my coupon, I have no idea, to be honest with you. That's something I'm really going to have to dig into that I'm going to keep doing a lot of research on. Do a lot of research, guys. That's something I'm going to have to do a lot of research on to figure out how TikTok provide the coupon, the discount code, how I provide my coupon and my discount code. But once you guys start offering that to your customers, coupon, discount code, free shipping, nice product pictures, 
even put yourself in a product picture. Like if you have a product that's wearable, wear that product and take a picture with it and take a nice picture and post that up so your customers could see if that product ill, that's how the product look at him. I wonder how he's gonna look at me. Okay, I'm gonna go buy it. That's what I did for a product that I just dropped on my um on my TikTok shop. I dropped a new product on my TikTok shop and I took a picture in that product because I don't want customers to think it's either the product is fake, it's a mock-up, or the product is not really what it looks like. So I want my customers to buy from me since I'm selling the product. So I took a picture in the product so the customers could see how the product looked on me to make sure they're not going to get, you know, they're not just going to get like, I can't, like, funny, funny situation or they're not going to, like, little stuff like that, basically. So, that's what I did. And I posted the picture on my TikTok shop. So when customers look through the pictures or whatever they're looking at, they see that I'm in the picture and they see that I have the product on. I started making sales off that product. So I'm telling you guys what worked for me. That could work for you too. I'm not going to say it's not going to work for you, but that could definitely work for you. We all out here to sell, provide quality stuff to our customers. So if I could do it, you definitely could do it. Don't give up. Try to use these techniques that I told you about. Provide coupons. Coupon, coupon, coupon. Say it with me. Coupon. My lips. Hold on, you guys. You know, the winter time is like... The winter time is just attacking everybody's lips. And I could feel my lips coming in. So, which means I also have a new project that I have to work on. So, you guys, I got to go. My baby boy is crying in the background. Thank you for coming to my YouTube channel. Thank you for watching me. This is your girl, TBQBC. True Black Queen Beauty Collection. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And you guys, TikTok shop, coupon, increase your sales. TikTok shop. Coupon, increase your sales. Coupon will increase sales in your TikTok shop. Use them coupons. Provide them coupons to your customers. You can start from 10%. You can start from 15%. You can start from 20% and higher. It all depends what you're selling and how you feel and what percentage that you want to provide to your customers. So I used to start from 5%, then I realized that wasn't working for me. So I boosted up to 15. Once I boost, boosted up to 15, I started, my sales started increasing. So you guys, do that and I promise you, you're going to make some sales. I promise you, customers will start buying from you. And I promise you, you're not going to, do not give up on your shop. Just because you see, you don't see a sale this day, but you see it this day, them coupons is going to work. Don't forget to include them coupons and when that coupon is done resubmit the coupon again thank you for watching my channel i'll see you guys soon bye okay you guys this is what i was talking about so you see how we started from december 31st okay now we on january 1st so we're gonna start in january right because it's more um i can show you what i'm really talking about so boom, January 1st to January 6th. This is where I didn't make any sales at all. And this is where I forgot to put um, my coupon code, I mean my discount code. Now, if we continue to go up, you can see that on the 6th, I think, I think it was on the 6th, yeah. I had um, added my coupon code and then you can see the sales coming in. Even all the way to through the seventh. Okay, boom. The seventh, I forgot again to add the coupon code. Now, that's like eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, five days. And the 12th, I re-added the coupon code. Basically, I've updated my coupon code. Okay, so 
so I got one seven, a twelve, and a thirteen. So like I said, every other day there was a cell coming in. So a couple of days ago I had um I had a cell that came in today and I also had a cell that came in the day before. But as you can see, that's what I'm talking about. You guys have to to make cells you will have to um you will have to add your you will have to set up a coupon. So I'm gonna go to marketing. I think that's where it's at. Give me a second. So this is where you will find all your coupons, flash deals. So right now I have product discount. You could use coupon. Sometimes I use coupons, sometimes I use product discount, sometimes I use flash deals. But so if I go to manage my promotion. This is what I have going on right now. And this is what I've been doing for the past couple of weeks. So, see what I'm saying? January 10th to January 12th. January 5th to January 6th. They usually last two days. Two or three days. So, I don't really count January 5th as the first day because... That it depending on the time, cause depending on the time the coupon could get posted. I mean, depending on the time when you do the coupon, sometimes this is what TikTok set up. So there's no way you could really change the time. I think there's a way you could change the time, but it's like if I try to change it, coupon. I mean, TikTok gonna be gonna say it has to be in between the two day time frame, basically. So if I go inside my coupon, not this one, I clicked the wrong one, this one. This is my the name of my discount, and this is all the discounts that I have going on. So yes, you guys can make sales depending on what you're selling. So this is what I was talking about, you guys, and this is what I came to show ya. Yeah? Okay, you guys, so this is what I was talking about. This is my recent active coupon that I have right now, which is started on January 15 and on the 17th. So this coupon is going to end tomorrow. Now, what I was saying is, instead of you doing the whole coupon all over, once your coupon is ended, you could just click duplicate. When you click duplicate, it's going to recreate this whole entire coupon that you had at first. After you do that, all you will have to do is change the name because you cannot use the same name twice for your um, coupon code, I believe. Unless there's a way, um, I believe you could delete it. No, I don't think so. You can't delete the coupon code, but you could disactivate it. But either way, it disactivated or um, it's not going to work neither. So you will have to come up with a new name for your coupon. You will have to come up with a new name. For your promotion, like you know, your promotion name, your coupon name, and stuff like that, depending on what you use. So, I'm in promotion right now. So, this is what works out for me, to be honest with you. But I'm gonna try to see if I could do another flash deal or after this coupon ends because I have some product that I'm trying to sell, sell, sell. So, yes, um, I have some new inventory coming in, so I have to like do some flash deals. And um, the ongoing coupon, let me see what's ongoing. Okay, boom. These are my two coupons that I said that I have. The free shipping and Royal Queen discount. Free shipping started on November 19th and it just continued. So, I guess depending on um, the the customer, because I don't know. TikTok be one minute I, ha um, I pay for shipping or the next minute the seller. I mean... I'm sorry you guys one minute I pay for shipping or the customer pay for shipping so that's what I was talking about but these are the two things that really work out for me um to increase my sales on TikTok you guys